words turned into to arms and it held me up when when I try to fall back. Um, that hurt. Hurt a lot. You know what I'm talking about. It hurt a whole lot. Um, I blame myself for not being mentally prepared for a letdown. And for just automatically mentally putting myself in that position like somebody told me that was my position. So I blame myself for that. But I thought that was nothing, you know, I thought that was nothing better than that 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 spot and that stage and that platform in my city. And um so it hurt. It hurt a whole lot. Um but y'all y'all are fucking amazing. It made me feel like shit not getting this this opportunity. And when I felt like shit, you guys reminded me that I ain't shit without y'all. And, and that's an amazing reality. So, like I said, it broke me. And I'm just trying to put me back together, but my God, have you all helped me. Thanks to all my peers, my friends, my family, my homies on sports television, everybody repping me. I really appreciate that. I really do. I feel like I let all of y'all down by not getting that opportunity. But I'm working on me. And I'm working. So, thank you. What's good? It's your boy DJ T Stump. And as you can see, Lil Wayne has finally responded after being left off that Super Bowl roster uh, for the halftime show. I mean, as we can expect, he's disappointed, man. And this whole situation has been crazy. The internet's been talking about it nonstop. Feels like every relevant rapper has kind of come to his side to support him, be that Nicki, you know, the Cash Money crew. So Nicki, Drake, etc. Um, we saw Travis Scott show him some love, Cameron and Mace, Hurricane Chris. Of, <laughs> Hurricane Chris, if, if if there's anything in, if there's anything in Louisiana, Hurricane Chris is gonna speak on it. Um, but yeah, we kind of saw Wayne get snubbed. Uh, a lot of people feel like Jay Z was kind of using this as a a, ch a chess move to try to get at Drake. Apparently. Uh, Jay-Z and the whole Young Money, Birdman, Wayne, Click have had a rocky relationship. Even though I thought him and Wayne were really cool because there was that whole thing where Jay-Z apparently paid millions of dollars worth of Wayne's taxes several years ago when Wayne was kind of going through it with cash money. But, you know, the politics of it aside, if you just put Kendrick Lamar versus Lil Wayne, I do think Lil Wayne by far would be a much, much better candidate for the Super Bowl performance. Um... For one, yes, Kendrick is hotter than Wayne right now. Wayne is 24, 26, 27 years into his career. You got to remember the Back That Ass Up feature dropped in 1999. Wayne has been going for that long, right? Yes, Kendrick is a little hotter than Wayne is right now, especially after the beef with Drake. But yeah, Wayne is a better candidate. Why? Wayne has way more hits on the Billboard Hot 100. Wayne is way more accomplished. Wayne, let's be real. Uh, you have to leave your neighborhood. You have to actually talk to people. You have to talk to people of different, you know, ages, races, backgrounds, etc. Wayne is a 10 times bigger name and it's not even close. You know, Wayne is a lot more influential than Kendrick is. Once again, Wayne has bigger hits and he has significantly more of them, right? You have to realize with the NFL, you got a lot of older 40 year old white people and whatnot watching the Super Bowl. A lot of people that don't know anything about hip hop, but kind of like Eminem, they could tell you about Lil Wayne. Not to mention the Super Bowl is taking place in Louisiana. Yes, a big uh, argument people make is well, uh, just because it's being taken, just because it's taking place in Louisiana doesn't mean they need a Louisiana artist. But if we've seen the last two Super Bowls when it comes to when they incorporate rappers, it tends to it, it there's tends to be a correlation with where the rappers from where the Super Bowl is and whether or not they perform there and in hip-hop music when you deal with hip-hop that is a thing where you're from is a big thing in hip-hop it, it 
formulates your sound it formulates the area you represent you know a lot of the slang you use where you're from is a big thing in hip-hop man um now not to say kendrick isn't qualified kendrick's a dope artist but we already got to, if i'm not mistaken you know we've already got to see a bit of we already got to see a bit of kendrick at a super bowl before right and the super bowl is going to los angeles i believe next year so kendrick kendrick would be you know better off at that super bowl um regardless though it's your boy djt stomping on